Hi, I'm Bob Clark with APA, and I'd like to discuss with you the APA Simplified Wall Bracing Method. Understanding and properly applying the bracing provisions of the International Residential Code can be very difficult. There is a table for wind speeds with a whole set of adjustment factors, and then another table based on the seismic design category with another set of adjustment factors. Understanding placement of braced wall lines can be difficult with offsets and even imaginary braced wall lines. Depending on the version of the code that you're using, there may be up to 16 different braced wall panel types to choose from. The APA simplified bracing method is based on only the most common options and only the stiffest bracing methods in the code continuously sheathing with wood structural panels. This reduces complexity, but we found that it can still be used in most circumstances. Here's how it works. There are four steps. Step one is simply to assure that your design meets the parameters to use the APA simplified bracing method. In step two, you would draw a rectangle around each plan of the home and from a table determine the amount of bracing required on each side of the rectangle. In step three, you can determine how many full height segments are available for bracing. And step four would simply be to compare the amount of bracing available to the amount of bracing required to show compliance with the APA simplified bracing method. For more detailed information, refer to APA System Report SR102 and the publication Simplified Bracing Streamlines Design. For additional engineered wood product information and support, visit apawood.org or call the APA Help Desk at 253-620-7400.